and uh, we continue with the book of Romans in chapter 1 we just close the part 1 with the glorious declaration where Paul says for I'm not ashamed of the gospel of Christ for it is the power of God unto salvation to everyone who no who sorry I don't want to change the word of God not even in this that believes to the Jew first and also to the Greek for therein is the righteousness of God revealed from faith to faith as is written, the just shall live by faith. As I told you before, I repeat, you see this, God's right honor. This is not Bible, okay? This is just the title of the editor. So we go to the Bible here. Romans 1.18. The music here. Mm -hmm. For the wrath of God. Oh, I told you, didn't I? God is love. But you got to allow to this perfect God to have wrath against evil <laughs> and otherwise it wouldn't be love it's not love like you know here people think oh, I love you then you can also kill me no way no I love you but you don't kill me okay <laughs> if we really love people we don't go around killing them do we all right for the wrath of God is revealed from heaven against all ungodliness so what do I mean when I say that is a righteous love is the love of God God is perfect don't discuss, you know, don't go, but I think what you think, what I think, our opinion value zero. The word of God is perfect, it's pure, infallible, and has been preserved for us so we can come and read. For the wrath of God is revealed from heaven against all what? Ungodliness and unrighteousness of man who hold the truth in unrighteousness that's really tremendous I mean you know when you really study this King James Bible if you take time to just analyze the verse no other book like this no other book For the wrath of God is revealed so don't go around playing I don't know is revealed from heaven against all ungodliness and unrighteousness of men who hold the truth in unrighteousness why why Paul Romans 1 19 because that which may be known of God is manifest in them not to them in them you see it's manifest in them why for God assured unto them God is righteous God doesn't do anything if hasn't done the right thing before he does the next and all he does is righteous because God is righteous we're not used to that we are used to corruption I mean I'm among politicians please please among religious people religious leaders please they use religion for money power dominance and also horrible things abusing little children because they dress with this cloak of pseudo righteousness you know they they consider holy men they're not only God is holy we are saints because we belong to the Lord but don't think that I got my own personal super duper holiness because that's not the case because that which is maybe known of God is manifest in them for God assured unto them when when Lord <clears throat> Romans 1 20 for the invisible things of him people say I don't believe in God I don't see him it's written just learn to read okay <clears throat> for the invisible things of him from the creation of the world are clearly seen from the creation of the world people don't even believe that God created the heaven and the earth people believe in the Big Bang don't they oh yes a Big Bang there was nothing and this nothing one day exploded in a Big Bang and since then this big bang that gave birth to the they call it universe there is no universe find find universe in the king james bible no it's been expanding through uh, the infinite space there is no space there is no other space we live under the firmament it's been expanding giving birth to galaxy the milky way for example and we are in that one galaxy of millions and billions and trillions of galaxies blah 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 because they they worship Lucifer and you 
a King James Bible believer, you who preach the word of truth, right and divided, you that say, I'm a King James, King James only Bible believer, I believe it's perfect. You want to please stop promoting <clears throat> Luciferian doctrine and just stay with the word of God. God created the earth and the heaven and the earth in the beginning, you know, and he put it under a firmament. The earth is under his firmament, and the sun and the moon and the stars, they circulate under the firmament. There is no other space, and all these space programs are just satanic lies, just like, just like the Tower of Babel. And God says, no, 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 you're not coming up. <laughs> Heaven is not for you. God gave you dominion on earth, Adam and Eve anyway, which they lost and they gave to Satan. Heaven is reserved to the Lord and his mighty angels, but also God had a mystery, hidden God. The body of Christ is going to heavenly places. Thank you, Father, Almighty God, we give you glory. For the invisible things of him from the creation. God created and made. King James Bible, believe all such you call yourself by your name. Please go and find out how many times it created and made, created and made. You're still going with this big bang from the Jesuits of all people. The evil corrupt branch of the Roman Babylonian Catholic Church. Please. Say, Barberto, you are so aggressive. No, I tell you as it is. I'm sick and tired, sick and tired of all this hypocrisy. Double tongue, double stand. Oh, but if I preach that the earth is a, is a plane under the firmament, I will lose followers. Good! And maybe you'll get some people finally to believe in the King James Bible. For the invisible things of him from the creation of the world are clearly seen, being understood by the things that are made. So the invisible things of him from the creation of the world are clearly seen, being understood by the things that are made. Come on now. I am over, I'm 74, 74, going to 75, if the Lord allows me to get there. I still astonished when I see a tree. How this tree works, you know, and then it is a little seed, almost insignificant, and then in the earth it breaks and comes out this kind of oak tree. A cedar of Lebanon, a baobab, a eucalyptus, I'm in Australia. Oh, you know. Oh, what about the plants? Just a flower. This is the big. What about this little thing? You know, almost uh, you can't even see, but you won't look with this little thing that flies. And if you get in the microscope, you see that this little thing, well, very annoying, is it? Eh? It's got wings with a design, a structure, a little head with eyes, multifocal eyes, a little leg, and flies. Oh, I, I wish I could fly, but I can't. I wish I could fly. Being understood by the things that are made, what? Even his eternal power and Godhead. I love it, I love it, I love it. The word Godhead is present three times in the King James Bible. Oh yeah, three times, because the Godhead is God, the Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost. And those three are one. And these three are one. That's in 1 John 5, 7. So I don't know if you really say, okay, First John, John, yeah, First John, First John, not, 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 not Gospel of John. First John, five, verse seven. For well, there are three that bear record in heaven. Praise God Almighty, the Father, you see, the Word and the Holy Ghost, and these three are one. I'm so proud of my Lord. Honestly, I love His Word. I love Him, and I love His Word. Why? Because He helps a good for nothing like me not only to be saved and see praise god which is immense but also to have a bit of understanding otherwise you know i would be my head would be a piece of wood <laughs> unfortunately you know i came to the faith and you know, late late in life but praise god better late than never uh where am i Oh yes, I'm in the Book of Romans, <laughs> you see? Ah. For the invisible things of him from the creation of the world are clearly seen, being understood by the things that are made, even his eternal power in Godhead. Godhead, three times. So are you sure it's three times? Well, guess uh, just a moment. Sure. Yeah, I told you. Godhead, Godhead, 
Go there three times in the King James Bible. Remember, if you go around with a new King James Bible or ESV, NASB News, but whatever message, uh, uh, NIV, not inspired version, please go to the preserved, infallible, pure words of God, King James Bible. Okay. For the invisible things of Him from the creation of the world are clearly seen, being understood by the things that are made. Even his eternal power and God had. Even his eternal power. It's not question. You come to the, the show really late, you know. Who do you think you are? What about me? I'm 74. I was born in 1949. I'm just one of 8 billion people on this earth at the moment. Wow, really nothing. God is eternal. From eternity past, eternity future, is the eternal, everlasting God. Jesus Christ is God, is the eternal God incarnated. At the same time, it's man, because it's born by the power of the Spirit through the Virgin. The promise gets fulfilled, Genesis 3, 15, Isaiah 7, 14, the seed of the woman. But he's of the seed of David, according to the flesh, and, the, and you know, the, the Son of God, according to the Spirit of holiness and righteousness, the power of righteousness, you know, the, the, through the resurrection. It's God, man, the God, man, the new Adam, the man from heaven, praise God for him. Even his eternal power and God that so that they, who, mankind, are without excuse. You can pretend as much as you like. God knows everything. Don't play fool, huh? So why you said this kind of things to me? Hmm. Because, because, I have reasons. Because God, God says that. Son, the Psalms, Psalm 14, verse 1. Psalm 14, Psalm 14. The fool says, okay, the fool has said in his heart, there is no God. So God is calling the person that say in his heart, it's a question of heart, corrupt, there is no God. Because they want to be God and they want to follow the fallen one who would like to be like God, but he can't. That's Lucifer, Satan. And what about Psalm 53? We're going back, we're going back here because anyway, they quote it. Again, the fool has said in his heart, there is no God. Corrupted they. Now I've done abominable iniquity. There is none that does good. Let's go back to Romans because the music is the same. God is righteous. God has got to show you and show me that what is done is absolutely perfect. Absolutely perfect. For the wrath of God is revealed from heaven against all ungodliness and unrighteousness of men who hold the truth in unrighteousness because that which may be known of God is manifest in them. For God has showed it unto them. For the invisible things of him from the creation of the world are clearly seen being understood by the things that are made, even his eternal power and Godhead, so that they are without excuse. Why? Why without excuse? Because that when they knew God, remember, he revealed himself to, to the, in them, they glorified him, uh, English, English, speak English, I'm, not, I'm Italian, but I should speak, because that when they knew God, because he revealed himself in them, they glorified him not as God. Oh, yeah, yeah. Neither were thankful. Ooh, that's terrible. I know that God doesn't like this lack of thankfulness. Hmm. Right? But what happened? Became vain. <laughs> I love the word of God. He tells you without. It's, it's not afraid to tell you as it is. People don't preach it because I don't want to offend my brother. Yeah, come on now. I don't want to offend the person in the poor, in the pew because he pays the tithes, you know. I tell you as it is. But became vain in their imaginations. Imaginations. It's like this space frontier, you know. Is this, we go to the moon, we go to Mars, Jupiter, but you don't go nowhere. You can go even through, they, 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 they call it Vanel in the, belt radiation belt they said they can't they didn't go nobody went anywhere but now they pretending they sell in the lies because the lies they make money but became vain in their imaginations and their foolish heart was darkened 
I just love it. God tell you as it is. The foolish heart. Didn't he say the fool said in his heart there is no God? Yes, so the heart is foolish. Oh man, how do you God is amazing, it's wonderful that he doesn't destroy us on the burns everybody to the ground. But he is a righteous God and his love. Beyond our understanding. So please don't reject, okay? And look what happened to mankind. Professing this full of professors, themselves to be wise, they became fools. How many times is talking about this? Foolish fools, fool. Professing themselves to be wise. I'm a doctor. I got one title, two title, three thousand. I got this degree, this degree. Who cares? <laughs> God doesn't care. Professing themselves to be wise, they became fools. Oh, well, man, that's heavy. And changed, look what they did, and changed the glory of the uncorruptible God oof, into an image made like corruptible men and to birds and full food beasts and creepy things. Look at the Egyptians. Look at the Phoenicians, look at the Etruscans, look at the Greeks, and look at the Babylonians, and look wherever you want, the Maya, the Ica, they all worship those idols. Foolish fools. What about Israel, the people of God? He took them out of, it, of the, the, the dominion and the oppression, the suppression of Pharaoh in Egypt, the greatest empire of that time. You know, with ten plagues destroyed the ten gods of Egypt. Destroy Pharaoh and his army, drown them all, as he said he would. Proving to the entire world and to his own people that he is the living God, the most powerful, the glorious God, the Almighty God. And as soon as they are there, the Moses, you know, goes up to the mountain to receive the law. Because, you know, takes time and stays there with the Lord for 40 days and 40 nights, you know, comes down, what he finds them? They created their God of gold. The calf, the golden calf. Oh, these are the, the gods that took you out of Egypt. Oh, Israel. Shame, shame, shame. Well, guess what? We're not different. That's why God has put all on the scene, Jews and Gentiles alike, so he might have, have mercy upon all. Any one of the Jews and then Gentiles now, they understand the terrible, sad, disastrous, tragic, dire condition, being sinners, lost and going to hell. Eh? That believes they receive this girl's gospel, get saved, get sealed, forgiven without you moving a finger. It's the operation of God. Don't give me this sloppy, sugar coated, false, fake messianic Judaism. Christ said to die on the cross and shed his blood to the last drop, and we glory in the cross because thanks to that, you and I, good for nothing as I am. We can be saved and see or become children. He makes of us children of God, adopted to himself by Jesus Christ. Members in particular of the one body, the new creature. Oh, glory to God. But these guys change the glory. This is mankind. You can see this in the first chapters uh, of the Bibles. You can see the corruption. From the moment that Adam and Eve fell, there is a, a, a declension. Like you say, when you go down, 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 it gets worse and worse and worse. On top of that, Satan and his fallen angels, the sons of God, the bad ones, they intermingled, you know, with the, the daughters of men. They had, you know, these spurious hybrid children, the giants and the Nephilim and everything. Oh, some great believers are, I'm not going to talk about I'm going to talk about that. Og, king of Bashan, whatever it is, or whatever. He had a bed bigger than this room where I am now. He had six fingers in every hand and toes, six and six, you know. Pfft, was it 30 meters old? I don't know. Tall? 30 meters? I mean, they found him, you know, the remain. But I don't know why some people are so delicate. Ah, oh, no, you know. Hey, listen, change the glory and corrupt of God into an image made like two corruptible men. Oh, yeah. He's uncorruptible. You want people make their God to their own image and likeness. You know this Jesus that you see in the evangelical churches in the in the, the denomination. 
with the long hair, which is against the law, so he couldn't. Oh, sloppy, you know, with these blue eyes or brown eyes or with a beard and, and dressed up with all this gown white with a blue thing going through. That's so ridiculous. I wish people... The image of Christ is in the, in the gospel of Christ, in the gospel of uh, in the, the Lord revealed to Paul. Once you study, you understand that you cannot depict him but it, it, because you worship God in, in spirit and in truth. You don't know how you look like. There is no reference. There is no, okay, Jesus, when he was born and then he grew at the age of 30, when he began his ministry, he was 174 centimeters or 182, uh, 190. No, he doesn't say that. He was slim, uh, you know, he was fat, he was uh, medium sized. He doesn't say anything. His nose was straight, no curve, no top uh, going up. Yeah, you know. No. Big ears, small ears, the colors of the eyes, one blue and one, one black. I mean, stop. They change the glory of the incorruptible God. If God doesn't want you to know Christ according to the flesh, Paul says, we don't know anyone according to the flesh. No, even if we have known Christ according to the flesh, we know him no more. Why? Because we know, we know him by the Spirit, the revelation of the mystery, which was it in God and now revealed. Into an image made like to corruptible man. That's terrible. What a fall. And guess what? Two birds. The eagle. Oh, I love the eagle. Yeah, the eagle are nice, but they're nothing to do with God. He created them. You get in your noodle. God is the creator. Anything created is inferior because it's created. But he's the creator. Even Satan, the people say, oh, that doesn't exist. Tell you, he was a fallen. He was actually perfect in his ways. He was perfect when he was created. He was beautiful, but he was created. An anointed cherub created. He wants to be like God, but he can't be. Go and read Isaiah 14. Go and read Ezekiel. You know, I made a video about this. Into an image made like to corrupt the man, into birds. My opinion. What about these people? You know, they say the Holy Spirit is like a dove. Like a dove. It's not a dove. And for food beasts. Yeah, these aren't that great. The cows, the ox. There are countries now that still worship this, you know, countries. The entire world is in idolatry. And creeping things, creep, creeps, creeping things. Yeah, you know, the, the, the Egyptian, the, 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 what's the, the, the guy that, the Scarabeo, we call Scarabeo, Ster Corraro, he, he pull up the, the, the excrement and makes little bolts, you know. And that was one of their gods. Romans 1 24 wherefore God also and there is a consequence wherefore God also gave them up to uncleanness through the last of their own hearts it's too deep you know I don't think I can explain this I just read it it's just amazing it tells you wherefore God also gave them up to uncleanness which is of course opposite of cleanness through the lusts of their own hearts. What a corruption! To dishonor their own bodies between themselves. Wow! And now they promote this as my freedom. I want to change. I want to be free. I want to be free to be unclean and to dishonor my own body between others. They use this, this moment of habitually, but the, who changed the truth of God into a lie? You know, I'm so glad I'm saved and sealed by grace. You know, by grace, by grace, by grace, through faith, by grace, through faith is the work of God. Because I am no better than these people. When I read this, I understand I was there myself, you know. I'm not better. Nobody is better. We all, I mean, to various degrees and level and type and flavor, we everybody is a sinner, everybody sins. Everybody's corrupt. That's why the blood of Christ, praise God, has been shed to atone for our sins. Nothing less than that would change the truth of God into a lie and worship and serve the creature more than the Creator who is blessed forever. Amen. The Apostle Paul, in my understanding, is even more strong than Isaiah. And I love Isaiah. Wow, 
This is the strength of the Spirit. This is the strength of the pure words of God. This is the sword of the Spirit which penetrates deep and tells you as it is. It's not cutting corners to be kind or the one offends you. You know what it means? Worship the self, the creature more than the creator who is blessed forever. Amen. That's terrible. And nowadays, let's save the planet. Climate change. Save the planet. But what save the planet? God is going to make new heavens and new earth. And there is no planet, by the way. It's a plane. It's a stationary plane under its firmament. On pillars. And God holds the pillars. I don't believe that. Who cares? That's your problem, not mine. Who change the truth of God into a lie and worship and serve the creature more than the creator who is blessed forever. Amen. Jesus said to the Samaritan woman, God is a spirit and those who worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth. Not make of him a bird, a knee, a tree, a plant and all this yoga crap, new age, you know. I just said this. You might not like me. Okay, fine. I'm used to that. For this cause, God gave them up unto our affections. That's it. Gave them up. For even the women that ch did change the natural use into that which is against nature. There you go. What about that? And likewise, also the men, just in case, you know, oh, oh this is against the women. Leave the natural use of the woman burned in their lust one toward another. But now it's normal, you know. Uh, that's my husband. Oh, is it? Is a man talking, presenting another message? This is my husband. And there are pastors, men of God, who marry them and bless them. Bunch of. And likewise, also the man living the natural use of the woman, burning the last one to another. Man with man. Working that which is unseemly. And receiving in themselves that recompense of the error which was meet. You can't play. You can't play with God, my friend, whoever you are. You better believe I receive the gospel of Christ before I finish this conversation. And even as they didn't know, oh no, sorry, it's just I read it wrong. You see, I get told. And even as they did not like, you see. To retain God in the knowledge, God gave them over <sighs> to a reprobate mind. You see what happened here. God gave them up. Whew. And now we already have gave them over. And even as they did not like to retain God in their knowledge, God gave them over. Yes. I need red, real red. No, this is... Okay. God gave them over. To a reprobate mind. I know that's not the typical way. The typical preacher, all kind and gentle. I scream, I know, to a reprobate mind, to do those things which are not convenient. Uh, being filled, that's the condition of everyone. With all unrighteousness, fornication, wickedness, covetousness, maliciousness. <sighs> oh my. Being filled with all unrighteousness, fornication. What is fornication? sexual intercourse with somebody that is not your husband or wife according to man and woman being filled with all unrighteous fornication wickedness wicked wickedness covetousness give me the money honey maliciousness I want to see destroyed full of envy murder Full of envy, murder, debate. Oh, let's debate. Oh, I don't want to believe the word of God. I'll tell you. <laughs> you see, believe this King James Bible. In the year 2023, we are so civilized. My what? 
the seat, malignity, whispers. America is a Christian country. Really? Do you know who founded America? Eh? Do you know that in, in Washington, D.C., there is the apotheosis of George Washington? Apotheosis is somebody that sent it to be called God. George Washington? God? <laughs> the Freemason have done a fantastic job to corrupt this country from the beginning. It's founded on satanic Luciferian principles. Oh, they say they believe in God. It's written on their dollar. But God, you can read gold, oil, drugs, maybe? I don't know. Be nice to the United States. I mean, anybody can be saved. Being filled with all unrighteousness, fornication, wickedness, covetousness, maliciousness, full of envy, murder, debate, deceit, malignity, whisperers, backbiters, backbiters, in the back, you know, haters of God, despiteful, proud, boasters, inventors of evil things, disobedient to parents. I'm dead already. This is just smashing me, you know. That's, but that's the situation in which we are. That's why I appreciate Christ. And the gospel of Christ and the, gro the cross <laughs> and the fact that he shed his blood for me without understanding man just a bunch of covenant breakers without natural affection implacable unmerciful who know in the judgment of God that they which commit such things are worthy of death not only do the same but I pleasure in them to do them Guilty by association. Father God, we really thank you for Jesus Christ. Father God, Almighty God, Creator of heaven and earth, merciful, gracious God, praise your holy name that you sent your holy, only begotten Son, the beloved Christ. And he came to die on that cross of Calvary. For my sins, for our sins, according to the scriptures, he was very rose again that day, according to the scriptures. Thank you that by believing and receiving this, you save us. Without a word that we say, without anything that we do, it's all the operation of God. Thank you, Father Almighty God. Thank you, Lord. What can I say, brothers, sisters, and friends out there, and also people that can't stand me? Don't leave this video before then in your heart you don't need to say a prayer with love voice you don't need to do anything you believe how that Christ died for our sins according to the scriptures it was better it was again the third day according to the scriptures that's the gospel of grace and please understand that God is good and that's why Paul says for I'm not ashamed of the gospel of Christ for it is the power of God unto salvation to everyone including you 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 might say, oh, I am one of those guys. I am there. I found myself one, two, three, four, five of these ones. Yeah. We're all guilty. Oh. That's why Christ came. There is none righteous, none, no one. That's why Christ came, who's righteous. The righteous for the unrighteous. And God is righteous because He, he believes, He saves those who believe in Christ. And is merciful and gracious. I pray that you believe this gospel and you get saved and sealed by grace through faith. And if I never see you on this earth, which is the greatest possibility, because I don't even know if who you are if you are listening, I would see you in every place. If you believe this and see this, look how God is marvelous. We're guilty of, of crimes, capital crimes. We all the death sentence, according to the law, these things require the death. In, in Israel was, in, under covenant, under the law was stoning by death, you know. Death by stoning. <laughs> you see, death, death, death by stoning. You, you will be stoned to death. But God allowed Christ to die on our behalf, for our benefit. This is mind-blowing. You and I, we didn't know this. We were not even born. But we... When we were yet sinners, ungodly sinners, and enemies of God, Christ died for us. Believe this gospel. Be saved, be sealed, that's you in every place. To God and God alone goes all the glory and praise and thanksgiving forever and ever. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father God. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Jesus.